What's up, folks? It's bright and early on a Monday morning here at Esports Talk. Hope you all had a great, safe weekend. You know someone out there who maybe did not have a great weekend? That's going to be Nade Shot, someone we talk about time and time again because time and time again, he's involved in the big news. It was actually brought to us by Cloaksy last night on stream where apparently Nade Shot will not be allowed to stream the closed beta, or I guess some people are calling it the pre-beta for Valorant, one of the most hyped up games we are awaiting in both esports and gaming itself. It does start tomorrow. Apparently, Nade Shot will not be allowed to stream it because, well, hear him say why. Matt, why do you sound so down? Nah, bro, I'm just pissed. Why? I can't stream uh, Valorant on Tuesday. Wait, why? Oh, that's such a long story, bro. I'll be playing, but I can't stream. Not a lot of stream. Wait, what? That doesn't make sense. Yeah, I know. I know. Wait, why? Can't you? Dude, come on, come on. Uh, Tell other me. LC, other LCS and LEC and LCK team owners complain that I had access when they don't have access. So Riot asked me not to stream until the 8th, the next day. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> no, I'm not. What a bunch of pussies! Dude, I swear you guys are lucky that it's 6 a.m. right now, so I can't be too hyped. I, I'm just a little bit tired for this one. How petty can you be? Because other LCS, LEC, LCK, aka League of Legends owners said that Nade Shot has pre access or access they don't have, and so he's got to wait an entire day to stream. How petty can you be? We cover a lot of topics, vast topics out there in esports and gaming. Very few of them come down to petty arguments like this, especially amidst owners. I mean, there's so many angles for this, the first of which, uh, what are you going to criticize for a guy who actually has, yes, more of a personality, more of a brand presence than most, if not all, owners out there? How are you going to then say, oh, that's unfair that he actually earned access before we did? And also, it makes you beg the question. I probably should refrain from saying names, but he did mention LCS, LEC, LCK, aka all of the top three League of Legends regions, and so it makes you wonder who and what owners and what teams have said, Nate Shot can't have access, so make him wait 24 hours to stream. It just, it blows my mind. The fact that Riot Games had to step in and say, sorry, we had other owners that were upset by this. I need names, and I know Nate Shot's going to be smart about this and not say names, so Oh man, I, I want to speculate so bad, guys. I really do, especially when it comes from the LCK. I can only think of one team so far that's going to be heavily entering Valorant who would maybe be upset by this. But besides that, I don't want to name any other names out there. Just a petty argument to start out Monday morning. Nade Shot cannot stream the first 24 hours of Valorant beta because other LCS, League of Legends, LEC, LCK owners are upset by this and actually forced Riot Games to ask Nade Shot, hey, we can't have you streaming it. He can play it, but he can't publicly stream it because other org owners feel like it's unfair. What a crazy, crazy way to start the week. Hope you're all doing well, though. Esports gaming news coming every hour on the hour. Thank you all over this past weekend. A great amount of subs, likes, comments. You guys are truly amazing. I'm going to wake up today, and we're going to have a great set of videos for all of you guys. Until next time, take care. Play Valorant if you guys have keys. Best of luck. We'll see how good it truly is.